Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn, where Edmund is making an epic journey back home. <laughs> He's already awake. Most everybody else is sleeping. I sent him back to get something to eat, not tax all of his emergency rations since it takes so much to make those things, and to pick up materials, construct, to put together a... This guy, lightning rod. I had to take him out of this zone. If I, I told him to just build it, this is something I set up in between episodes, and he couldn't because there's no scrap metal. So he apparently has no access to anything outside of this zone for anything else other than food by sending him out to get a meal. So the zones are very restrictive. You've got to be self-contained or you've got to be moving them in and out of the zones to move things around. Now, I could have had, like, Simon bring up all the materials and drop it off. And then he would be able to walk over and construct it. But I thought, you know, he's going to get up early anyway. And I thought I was running. And he could head over here, grab a meat pie, which he really likes. And then grab all the scrap metal and go back. But... We are bound to get a lightning storm and the you know before we get all of that ore you can see it all lit up right there before we wipe all that that uh, all that mining out and bring it back and then how do we get it back here another question to figure out so I set up a couple of storage stockpiles set up for ore that Carter is instructed to work on as soon as he wakes up. Uh, Rita has been instructed to get out here and tame these Ulfin as soon as she gets up. Because I went, I edited it all last episode and realized, you know, we were we kind of set out to uh, to tame some Ulfin and we never got back to that. Simon is going to be transporting ore, so he's running up there to get some ore at least. And who else has got Paulette? He just cook, nothing but cook. Kana will be constructing something. I think it's the beds. So she's going to get those done for the Olfen, so they have a place to go. Umiar, I needed you to handle something. What was it? Uh, oh, to start making alloy. We need alloy badly for lots of things. The radio antennas, the arcade machine, which I want to see going, and eventually, we still got to figure out where to put that VR set. I think it's going to have to be stuck in somebody's bedroom. I don't see any other way around that, unfortunately. It'd be nice if there could be a, an entertainment room for something like that. But I think that's a bit much now. I really don't want to try to add to a, add another section onto this house somewhere. I guess eliminate all of that, move the power lines over, and stick another addition out here or something. I'm not sure it's worth it. We could maybe try to move the front of the house further forward and eliminate the berries. Then we can have a much longer living room and maybe one more bedroom. That's possible. But I think the odds are better that we're going to have somebody leave here before we're going to have a new person jump in. We're not doing that many missions anymore unless someone just walks in and says, Hi hey guys, can I join you? It's probably not going to happen this, this far into the game. Edmund, you are still... Still on your way in to get something to eat. Yep. Simon, did you make it up there yet? You run so much faster than Edmund does. But still, you got a long ways to go. Boy, without these, uh, um, what do you call them? I guess area is what they're calling them. Um, change area. I thought there was another, another word for it. Hmm. Oh, well. You know, the... Outpost, that's probably the word I'm trying to think of. Yeah. Without the outpost concept, this would be, um, you know, this would be difficult. Risk a meltdown, Carter. You... What was that noise? What was that noise? Did you guys hear that? There's someone used notification on my phone I've never heard before? I don't know. With the update, maybe something new popped in. But Carter, you... Oh, successfully tamed. Did that line up just as that noise came across? I've never heard that noise in this game before. 
Carter, you don't truly need to be building that, but let's... Can you just... You're already relaxed. What is your problem? Carter, happiness is way down. Though your relaxation is good, your rest is good, your fullness is good, your happiness is just tanked. What is going on? Because you don't have hardly any positives anymore. Ah. So you don't have a good bed. You don't have a, uh, you know, a good quality meal. You did eat on a table and you had a walk. That's about it. Too few fun things to do and you slept outside. Aha. Uh -huh. So if we forced them to have a shelter, would they seek it out to lay down their bedroll? I guess that's worth exploring. Okay. So he's got plenty of food, but he's crushingly unhappy. We, we may have our first meltdown. We've not had one in this whole series. And I really wanted to keep it that way, but I don't see any way to fix this. He needs alloys to make uh, a dartboard or something to give him variety. Um, leisure. Except for these guys, there's no... Are there any shrooms out here? There are. Okay. Can I just pop that in and say build it? I probably can. Right there. Carter, you are no longer here. You're a global. And I need you. I hope you're qualified to do it. What is... Oh, we've got some... we got some uh, crazy chickens over here. Okay, so let's take you guys and harvest. And Carter, come and do this. Harder, harvest these, please. It's at least going to let you try. That's good. But what can we do? He slept outside. That runs out in 21 hours. Ooh. Yeah, that, that, that one hurts. Okay. So, Simon, you are grabbing those 40. Uh, 20? Really? Where are you going now? You're grabbing those 20. That was different. Lost harvest. Okay. I don't know what's going on back at the at the other camp. That's another downside to running two camps. I, what in my RimWorld series, the last series that we did, I had thought about trying to run two or three settlements at a time because you can do that there now. Oh, you're going to collect them all. Wow. Hopefully you had enough food in you. Except for relaxation, you'll be okay. But it was so difficult, you know, the, the idea of Switching back and forth. Okay, what are you guys up to right now? It just felt like it'd be too disconnected. That's one of the complaints people had with Star Wars, for instance. They didn't like that the scenes kept switching from one area to of the galaxy to another area and back and forth. And I remember that that argument or that that complaint long ago. When I was a teenager, hearing that. I thought the movie was great, but a lot of people were really frustrated with that. I thought. I would be creating that if I had multiple settlement, settlements going in, in uh, RimWorld, so I decided against that. So, you guys are doing that. Carter, are you still crushingly? You are. Okay, you're transporting to here. Good. You've got that part figured out. This also needs what? Needs stone, and we've got stone. Okay. That will give you two choices. Does that negate that variety? Few fun things to do. I don't know what officially few means. So there's a chance. Does a campfire provide any kind of camaraderie? Anything to do with uh, you know, with socializing, entertainment? We'll see. So Simon, you right now are over here. And you were grabbing more? No, you're on your way back. Okay, you've hit your load limit. And we did leave the initial 20. Are you something else? Your ore? That was weird. For some reason, the game didn't recognize those 20 when you got the orders. Okay. Carter, you 
are over here. Are you going to make it? How long can you be crushingly unhappy? So, what do your charts look like right now? You're still... wish I could zoom in a little better. There's a line there. Is there another line over here somewhere? Can't tell. Well, let's see what happens when you get to here. Edmund, where are you right now? You're on your way back with scrap metal, right? I think that's what that is. Yep. So you're going to get us safe from the lightning storm that I'm predicting is going to nail us soon. It'd have to. We haven't had one in quite a while. All right. No, 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 no. Now I want you to construct it. Oh, my head. He was so happy before. But now he's got to stay. Oh, my head. <laughs> All right. Bang, bang, bang. Stop. Okay. I'm going to shift you back to this region. Can you appreciate a shroom torch? Woohoo! Does that eliminate a few fun things to do? I don't think there's anything else that qualifies here. You need alloy. Alloy. Alloy and leather. Leather. Uh, okay, there's sticks or hay. There's hay over there. Alright, let's do that one. Shooting target. Let's try and kill each other. When you're done with that, build this. That gives us three. So there's a lot more to an outpost than just go do it. They fall apart when they're not near the main uh, main establishment, main settlement. Okay, oh yeah, gotta hold your head there. Edmund, he needs some moral support. Get up here. Ah, two ships passing in the night. Yep. Wonder if they'll even acknowledge each other. Probably not. Hello. Okay, you are constructing. Are you gonna grab some logs? Five enough? Nope. Five more? Ten of them. Well, we had just enough materials for all this. You needed sticks. Okay, so get that built. No, nope. transporting. We good? We're not good. You need more more logs. Oh, we don't have enough logs. <laughs> okay, that gives us ten. Really, this thing needs thirty. Wow. All right. Well, I hate to say, but take two trees down. All just to make you not fall apart okay well you do that and then come on over here and do this all while crushingly unhappy is going on let me get you to build that that'll be three forms of entertainment come on Edmund I need you to help construct this stuff before he falls apart at least he's got some massive skill here look how fast he takes a tree down boom 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 okay uh new resource a respirator mask okay only oh there's 15 okay uh respirator mask ensures safe breathing during toxic air events and dust storms that thing costs us so much to make there's no way i'm gonna get seven of those Be all day long setting that up okay so get this guy built and does this eliminate a few fun things to do now you're hungry Okay, so let's see if a meal helps you out. Still have a few fun things to do, but maybe the game will reset itself soon after you eat. All right, we have a decently fed. That's helping. We're, 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 we're back to extremely unhappy. That's good. All right. Had a pleasant walk. Well fed. Okay. If we get that nine to fall off, we'll be okay. Insufficient food variety. Oh, I give up. I give up. I give a. All right, Carter, go home. You're done. Uh, Carter, we're gonna have to do this in shifts. That's apparently the uh, what's going on here. So you're back to global. You go back. How you doing, Edmund? You slept outside. Otherwise, you're in a good mood. All right, so Carter's gonna go tame an olfen. What else does he need? That's it. He just needs 
It needs to be in the area of variety. Wait a minute. Now he's back to global. He should no longer have few fun things to do. So I'm curious to... Maybe he has to actually do the fun things in order to qualify. I don't know. I think we'll head there rather than taming. And I never saw... I never noticed... Ah, we have a... We have that to explore, okay. Um, I need you to come over here. You already relax, okay? So I can't get you to do another thing. But we tamed this guy. Okay, so Rita did that. And then Rita went back to harvesting real quick. Okay. Um, let's... Rita is set up to do... And seven more. Let's get just these two more done. One, two... You desperately need to relax, but your happiness is still fine. Let's have you come over and tame. Okay, Carter, I need you to not be taming. You're going to fall apart on me. So I need you to what? Eat even though you're full. I need you to eat bread. That's a big happiness boost for you. Now, Rita, you can come over and tame an orphan. Alright. Wow, there's a lot of humming flies over here. Well, I wish there were little fish swimming around in there. Or gigantic tadpoles or whatever. Yeah, that's probably more appropriate. Huge tadpoles. Yeah, that would be good. <laughs> now, last episode or the episode before? I forget. I completely messed up the... Uh, the manure. So, survivors are forbidden to use or carry this item. Does that mean if I click this they are forbidden or that they are already forbidden? Seems to me that this means that these are not forbidden. And if I click this then they will be forbidden. That's the way I'm reading it. Hopefully I'm not wrong there, but that sure seems right. So, in that case, when I was up here, So, they are allowed. Click. So that red X should mean that it's good. Right? That is the most confusing way to, to do this. It doesn't make sense to me. This looks like bad. Red X. No. But it's saying, to me, it's saying what happens if you click this thing. So, okay, there would be red X's over them if they were forbidden and they are forbidden so now you can that doesn't make sense because now it's click here if you want them to be allowed to carry it I don't know but to me there could be a I'll make them all green and we'll see if I'm wrong but it just seems like the opposite of what it really means Okay, any more in here? Uh, manure is all green. There we go. Make it all green. Make it all green. Okay. Make it green. Okay. So that should now be available to them as far as fertilizing fields. Over here, there should be another big pile of them. We'll make all of these green too. Green manure. Green happy manure. <laughs> okay. So, Rita. Oh, was I paused through all that? Darn it. Didn't mean to do that. But at least now we didn't miss... What was up over there? So, you are still checked to fertilize. Is there, is there a way of knowing what has been fertilized? Click on an individual one. Fertilized. You does not say fertilized. Whereas you do. Oh. There we go. Fertilized. 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 So, I guess that did get accomplished despite... Uh, where's a Rita? There you are. And where is a Carter? 
he is crushingly unhappy again. We'll see if he makes this. Edmund, you are... You've built this guy, so you're now safe during a firestorm, or a lightning storm. Um, you could build this just for fun. Petting Prince. Now, you are now mining. So, missing resources. Oh, sticks, of course. Okay, in that case, you are going to reset and shooting at a target. Okay. Um, Alright, if that keeps you happy. Now you're going to get that far away to shoot at that target over there. Boom! And you're going to spend most of your time here repairing that stinking target, aren't you? Okay, let's get down over here. So, Rita should be just about accomplishing her, her task here. Do we have any kind of a bar to know that it's happening? We do not. But it should be easy. She's got a high skill rating. And this has got to be one of the lower difficulty animals besides the dog. And she's doing something strange in that bush. Taming Olfen. That should be kind of fun to have uh, hummingflies hovering all around the place. You just fell asleep? You did. Okay, Meltdown Carter rotted away. No queued research. And we need these to make that happen. Okay, she's got to be getting close here. What is the X there? Succeeded. Okay. So, you as well? Um... There, you as well. Okay. So, could I tell you to lead? You can't lead animals that are interacting with someone. Okay. So, you. Hmm. So, let's try this. Lead to here. And, Kana, why didn't you ever construct that? Whatever you're doing right now... Okay, why don't you just... There was another noise. But it happened quite a time after. I guess she just finally finished that, uh, the animation of it. Okay. So, Kana, can you build this? And... Rita, this one. I still can't lead. She's still... interacting with, apparently. Still. Okay, so what are you officially doing? You're officially doing none, but I still can't lead. Are you petting? Are you what? I guess we're just having some quality time. Okay. So we'll lead them back tomorrow. Meanwhile, Carter is going to get some sleep. He is only in a low mood now so maybe we can get his bar back up he did get some bread which is good right uh, ate a tasty meal appreciated decoration well fed slept in a spacious bedroom yeah it, it takes being home <laughs> for all of you who travel often it takes being home to really feel like you've you're you're you're, you're doing good <laughs> okay. Simon is transporting. Simon, what you doing? We got things to transport that are a lot closer to home. What are you doing up here? I have no idea. Why did you get the order to come all the way up here to get hay? Are we low on hay or something? Where is that? 
there. This is a thousand hay. Only sixty-six sticks. Hmm. Let's queue up some bushes. That's you guys, right? Yeah, lots of them. Okay, so let's do that and cut. There's a whole bunch for someone tomorrow. Um, so there's a red X. That means do not salvage. By the same logic as the uh, the animal poo. So can I get someone like who's not sleeping, Simon? Umiar, you look like you're looking for something to do. Can I tell you to come over here and and salvage? I can. But there's a red X. What am I not getting here? It's a green poo. <laughs> but it's a red X. Okay, there's something inconsistent here. Is red bad or is red good? Ah, some of these games. Okay, Rita is eating. She's done her, her job. Um, okay, back to Olfen. Can I tell you to go here? Okay, and I assume I want this closed. Will they open it on their own to lead them through? I don't know. I'll have to figure that one out. Otherwise, you both have lead orders. I don't remember if I have to then go tell somebody to do it, or if whoever has ranching at the top, which is Rita and Carter, when they wake up, they will just go and do it. So Rita's eating, and Carter will be the first one up. She needs relaxation, and yeah, she's in rough shape. She's going to sleep. Um, it is four in the morning. Okay, I'll let you sleep first. Otherwise, you miss the command, and I'll have to do it manually. All right, so we did get some of these going. Simon, you are still a long way from home. Yeah. You, I wish I knew why you needed that hay. Simon, don't just drop the hay and go to bed. Simon, you're here, right? Yeah. That's just a little bit extreme. We have all these things to haul. And he went for hay. There's hay here. So it's not like he got the orders to make bricks and needed some hay. I don't think I ever told him to do that. I told him to go up and haul the ore. Huh. I wonder if telling him to go haul something from another zone, another area, somehow under the hood triggered all the things in the area. Hmm. You know, I mentioned, I think, last episode that they had just released an update or a patch to make this new update work. Some things they had to fix. So it's possible there's still some other little bugs and issues introduced that have to be fixed. Okay, Carter, you think you're going to go... Oh, you're going to go transport something. Not sure what that's about, but I need you to go do something really exciting. Like, play some music. You've done the shroom torch lately, you did a statue, you did a walk, and now you're doing a didgeridoo. That should get rid of a few fun things to do. Right here. Uh, more poo rotted away. Let's find out. 80%. We'll see if that goes away when you start walking away from this. Simon, did you make it to bed? You should be sprinting by now. You're kind of. So we get somebody else like Kana or Umayar. Umayar, where are you right now? Carter's done. Uh, that negative nine is still there. And Cave Dweller? Carpet? Just because you did something on a wooden floor? <laughs> no time limit. Boy, that is frustrating. So, Edmund, how you doing? You about to...
pass out on me because you slept outside? Uh, no, you're still in a good mood. Okay, so you're transporting. When are you going to get back to mining? Edmund, manage, activities. So mining on Edmund is, where are you? You're at the bottom now. Mining is there. It's a two. So you're going to do your hunting first, and then you're going to heal, construct, cut, ranch, scavenge, and then mine. What is scavenge? Salvaging. Okay, you don't have any of that to do. So there really isn't anything on that list ahead of you. You should be at this point... Oh, I didn't mean to send Umiar over there. I just wanted to test to see if it was possible. <laughs> That's where he is. Okay. Um, you need to eat. Okay, so Umiar also liked meat pie. No, he liked bread. He liked bread. So you're going to eat bread next. And then I need you to get all of these done. So from ore... Should have a whole bunch of ore now. Okay, that's done. Kana's doing that. There was a thump thump earlier. More thump thumps. Who's building what? I don't know of anything to be built. We're waiting on parts. Waiting on parts, waiting on parts. And up top there, he's mining. What was the thump thump? Carter's hammering something. Oh, he's moving the traps. Okay. We're getting happier. He's back doing things he likes to do. Okay. So I guess I'm going to have to cycle these guys. A couple days at home, a couple days out there on the, uh, on the frontier. Hmm. Okay. And... Is this a move order or is this a construction order? Cancel. That was a move order. That's why it's pink. I'm not liking this. I liked it better when it was over here. A little easier to figure it out. This pencil on a piece of paper to me doesn't say copy. It just it just doesn't make sense. Okay. So that needs to be done. You're moving the last trap. No, you got two traps left. And over here is just a stick. Okay. Edmund, how are you? You're fine. Simon, still sleeping. Um, let's stop you there and get you some food. Simon loved meat pie. Right there. Go get some meat pie. And then I need you to do some serious relaxing. Ah, uh, boy, we don't have a, that thing going. Other relaxing. I guess it's just kind of like instruments. Was there any way of knowing... Nothing that tells me what their value is. I know taking a walk was a small... I guess I've, I've got to look at things like this. So... Appreciated decoration, 18. Played music, 18. But I think taking a walk was like plus 6. So some things are better than others. So Simon, when you're done, you're going to play music. And you're going to appreciate a decoration. Then you will be back up where you need to be. Okay. Wow, you're low. You're big time low. Crushingly low. Well, that's twice we've come very close to someone finally snapping on this series. Carter is over here. He is constructing a turret. Which means he's just getting one of the parts. We don't have the rest of them. Okay. Oh, those are still sitting out here. Okay, when you're done, Carter, you're going to haul these away. Okay. Okay. So that is the last of the constructing to do. Now, Carter, nor... What? No, 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 no. So it defaults to meat? That's frustrating. Okay, so... You're off. Animal food herbivore. Yeah, boy. Too bad there isn't a quantity that you have in stock here. That would make that a whole lot easier. I'm going to say clear all. Uh, deselect all. And hay is a pretty obvious one. I have a feeling Olfen will eat us out of house and home. 
So I don't want to put all of our you know, bush fruits into that. Where are we here? Vegetables, we have a thousand buttermelon. So if I select everything, will they bring a little bit of each or will they just bring until the first one runs out? I don't know. Hmm. I'm going to stick with hay. And then we can harvest this. Okay, so Rita, you are transporting. All right, when you're done with that, you need to relax badly. So we won't have you go get the orphan just yet. Let's have you play this one, appreciate this one, and then go and get yourself... Um, remind me, for you it's meat pie. Rita, a meat pie. Okay. And we've got a lot of meals stacked up. Am I seeing that right? She's got 17 meals. Okay. Paulette is doing some catching up. Which means she could then be working on emergency rations soon, right? So we've got to get all of these happy before you're going to then start dumping them into emergency rations. Mm-hmm. Let's just do 10 at a time. So once you get all these happy, which is actually going to be very difficult. Probably will be. I always need two cooks to pull off emergency meals. Someone to keep making all the things while someone else makes the meals. One person walks in and eats some porridge and they got to go back and start over again. Yeah. How close are you guys? Almost there. Okay. Um... So, where are we at? Carter is constructing a wind turbine, which means you're bringing over an electronic. Okay. While that's cooking, Rita is getting some relaxation. So, Simon Kana, you are building another mask. Is there anything else I truly need you doing? Um, Umear, I had you handling. You're still in good shape. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, you're doing that. So, Kana, I could have you... What, what is cutting measured as? I'm trying to remember here. Cutting is just... Is that farming or is that just generic? Uh, activities. Cut. It is a physical. Okay. So, that's a Carter thing. Carter can go through this, you know, like, like, yeah, like butter. <laughs> Carter, you are constructing a wind turbine. Um, your stats, then you're going to go grab some more bread to finish off your happiness. Which then means Paulette has got to start over her list before she gets down emergency meals again. And then you're going to come out here and cut 10, and cut 8, and cut 8 and cut two and just get a whole bunch of twigs going okay these guys are getting ready to to harvest um extend field so i'm, I'm curious to see when this harvests security signal what it does to the soil in here does it start to turn green like grass does the brown go away when this harvests? Because this plant gradually transforms sand, clay, and silt soils into loam. This soil is... Silt. That's what they're calling it. Okay. Uh, security signal. The site of a recent crash started emitting an automated high-frequency security signal. The codes are characteristic to the military modules. The signal is either coming from a ship's defense system or from an onboard reconnaissance vessel. I'd say that's worth exploring. Sure. Do we send Rita or do we send Carter? Carter, you need to eat bread. Then I was going to have you cut. And that would be nice. But 
Rita, you've got a long way to go before you're ready. You're going to shroom and eat. Hmm. Carter, when you're done, let's have you do that. Where are you at right now? You're heading in to get some. Let's let you eat, and then we'll send you off to do that and give you something, something very different to do before we take you back up to mine some more ore. Edmund may have all the mining done before Carter gets ready to function again. Whoa. Yeah. There's one over here out of our... That's the last of them within our scope here. So where are we going after this? I guess we're moving everything to there. It's a little bit over there. Which is going to be kind of close to these guys. Yeah. We could come up and attack them just for fun. Before the game's over. It is fairly close. Okay, well. Edmund, when you get done with this last run here. Is that all considered one? That's one. Oh, there's one over there. And you? Mine. I missed any more? Double click. Interesting. You're silicon. Ah, I don't need you. Okay. That's a long trip back just to get 20 silicon. Okay. So after that, I guess we move the marker to try to catch all of those in one big square. And can I just move you? Yeah. So move you, and then I guess we'll move all of these. Hmm. Okay. Well, you're transporting all of that to here. You're going to fill all this up. And then Simon and somebody else will come and bring it all back. You can just go away. And I guess we'll just move everything over to the other site. Alright. You guys didn't even come over and peck at us. Yep. Carter, you made it back here. You did. <laughs> um, let's do it. Let's just make it happen. Let's, I want to see what that is. So expedition, security signal, and Carter, and send. And Carter, let's have you finish this. And then haul these in. How many did you manage to get done? That over there too? Uh, sure looks like it. All sticks. It's funny how you have to give the second command in order for him to go and gather up everything. Maybe the... Oh, just heard a thunder. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Thunder is rolling all through the studio right now. The storm is coming. Kana went all the way out somewhere... To get sticks. Sticks. Okay. So the 60 that we had were not necessarily on the porch. I see. Okay. Well, Carter, this will be appreciated. But you can eat and sleep on the balloon. So it's just a matter of you coming back. Oh, probably a uh, thunderstorm. Coming back, um... Uh, not not too happy. Okay, Edmund, where are you right now? You are mining one last thing. How do I tell you to go to your lightning rod and stay? I, after this, there'll be nothing else to do. You just got to get through this and get back before that first clap of lightning hits. Um, otherwise, you're probably going to be out gathering this stuff. So that could be a problem. I've got you on pause right now. I'm trying to think. Can I give you something to do? What time is it? It's 1900. I don't know. I can just tell you to come over here and do this. But I'm only going to get one chance at that. And then you're going to have your relaxation fulfilled. Then you're not going to want to stay. Um, I could have you mine this that's an idea. I'll just do some random mining just to keep you within the sphere. Uh, that might be close enough. Is that it? You? There we go. Mine. Mine. Yeah, we'll do that. Edmund, come on over here and do this. 
appreciate a shroom torch. Get you in right now. Okay, who else is out over here? Simon, you guys kind of made it in. Rita is harvesting, but she is within a range here. Can I do something like... No, I can't shift and click on that. I double click. I only get the two next to each other. But you're definitely protected there, so that's not a problem. Okay, so I don't think taking off in a balloon is a problem in a lightning storm. Not sure. Batteries right now are... Wow, listen to that wind. 73%. Edmund, you are almost safe. And you've made it. If it strikes, it's not going to go anywhere, but at least it's not going to hit you. So you're going to appreciate here for a while. Watch our settlement over there. And then hopefully you're just going to go work on... Like I can just tell you. Once you're done with that, go mine that and mine that. Okay. So back over here. Double... Why can't I double click to you? Have you already taken off? You must be in the air. You are. Or you're thinking about it. There you go. So Carter's out of here. I hope you grab a couple of meals. There he goes. Okay. Waiting for lightning strikes to hit. So I guess I'm more curious about lightning strikes hitting up there. Uh, turn these off for now. Our animals are still out here, and they're just going to have to weather one more night. Like, this is the last night of this episode, isn't it? Yeah. Forty-some minutes. Um, Edmund, you are staying busy. Your fullness is not very good. If I were to draft and undraft you... Will you go back to the table? You will. And hopefully you'll pitch a tent. Well, you'll pitch a sleeping bag out in the rain. you are really, really angry tomorrow. And that'll be the end of your ability to mine. Maybe once the storm's over, have you take out that one last little bit and then send you home. That's probably the answer. Read up. Is the end is safe? Oh, we are. You're petting an orphan. No, 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 no. Oh, we are. No, no. We are. <laughs> Who we are. Can you uh, work on some alloys from ore for me, please? Thank you. <laughs> oh, you gotta watch these guys. Yeah, sometimes it's like herding cats. All right. Well, what else is there for this episode? I think we've accomplished probably all we're going to see. Edmund, did you ever go to bed? I set you to undraft. You ate, and then you went back to mining. Okay, I guess your rest officially hits when? Midnight? Let's see what happens here. Now you're starting your next one. When is rest? Schedule. Sleep is midnight. Okay, we're not quite there yet. That'll be your last task for the night. Or not. Still 2300. So thunderstorm we know, scavenged that, brought it away, malfunction ceiling lamp, we'll get to that eventually, and we're at midnight, are you going to, where are you going to pitch your tent? Tell me you're not going to walk out to here and then do it. Going to sleep, and drop it right there in the rain. Oh, you're not going to be happy camper. Yep, boom, low mood, soaked while sleeping, negative 18. 12 more hours. Insufficient food variety. Slept outside. Soaking wet. Oh, you're not happy. Discovered an ancient civilization. Did I miss something? You were the one that did the first expedition to... Oh, yeah. That ancient thing. I can't remember the the word. I guess that stuck with you for a lifetime. Okay. That's what saved your butt out here mining. I guess you are the uh, 
the permanent member of the mining outpo. Okay. I think that's the answer there. Okay, Umiar is handling a furnace. Probably not happy. Ah, first of our own bush berries are done. Oh, she's been harvesting a lot. Good. And all of these things are out in the rain. They're probably all going to be rotting soon. Yeah. How are we doing here now? 94% growth. But then we got to get this one up too. Average harvest growth. Oh, I see. So you're at 100%. Right? Individually, you're there. But as a group, you're there. Yeah. That one's at 83. So... I didn't see with that last one yet. But no bad symbols here. Could I tell Rita to harvest? I could. Ah, next episode. We're going to get to play with energy crystals. Okay. Boy, looks pretty stormy out there. Yeah, I've had many a night in a storm like that. Those are exciting. Anyway, we are going to sleep. Everyone's asleep here. Everyone is asleep. Okay, with that, I think we're going to call this one done. Thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.